Hi, David Wood in the Outdoor Office. And here's your roadmap to Module 1, which is called Deciding Who You Help. Now, one thing about that is notice it's not just about who you help, it's really finding your niche. So, you'll also be deciding what problem you solve. If you have a problem that you solve, and you can narrow in on a group of people, then you've got a pretty good niche. My goal here is not to heap on new strategies to you in this video, but to give you a bit of a roadmap for where you can find the resources for this module. Let me take you through it. If you click on Tools on the purple tab, then you'll find a whole bunch of stuff here. Find your perfect niche is a good place to start. Taking Inventory Document, tool number three. Defining your market document and then the Decide Who You Help audio training. Now you don't have to go through all these, but if you want to go through to a deeper level and really make sure that you're happy with the niche you have, then I highly recommend it. Now make sure you've also read chapter 3 in the book, which is all about Decide Who You Help. And section B in the back of the book is more information on Decide Who You Help. Once you've done all that, you can go and listen to the recording of the tele-seminar that we did on Decide Who You Hold. People got a lot of insight and clarity. So do that and there's also the transcript that you can go through. I'll make the point too that it doesn't have to be the right niche. This stopped me for a long time. It doesn't have to be the exact one, doesn't have to be the right one. Just pick a niche now to work with. It could be women over 50, um, who want to find the right partner. Pick something that resonates with you, that you're passionate about, and work with it for the next six weeks. You might change it in three weeks or six months, but be willing to choose something and keep refining it. You should also have a freedom buddy at this stage. If you don't have a freedom buddy, here's uh, one place you can go is click on community, and then click on forum, and in the forum, there is a post that's all about Freedom Buddy. Click there and post. You can also go to getpaidforwhoyouare.com forward slash buddy. And you can post there if you're having trouble. Make sure you get a Freedom Buddy. You do not want to go through this program with that one. That's my suggestion. And to work on your elevator pitch, which you really want to get nailed down, something that you're happy saying to someone in an elevator, if you only had 30 seconds, how would you describe what you do? in a way that's inspiring, go again to the forum, you can click here, and you can click on the post that says elevator pitch, it's right here at the top right now. Go in there, share yours, or share what you have, and ask for help. That's a really smart move. So, relax with it, this is an important part of the training, and don't worry if you don't have something that's really exciting, just keep working on it with your freedom buddy, with the people in the forum, and you'll find something that does excite you and does inspire you, even if it isn't the perfect one. That'll make a big difference to your program. Enjoy.